He never confirmed. I know. This I was know. over a month ago. It was. So are you not available tomorrow? Uh, yeah, I got two podcasts to film in the morning. Where at? Not here? No. Nah, with Clint. Shoot. Do so you are not day? available at any time? Uh, I, I mean, unless we did it like possibly three. I have 2.30 like... available. All right. We could try that. <laughs> or three. It might have to be three because I got to pick my, my guys and stuff at 12.30. Yeah, three is fine if that works for you guys. Yeah. My brother died, so I wasn't able to confirm. Come on. How long your brother died last year, bro? How, how long last year? year? Jason, last year. Jason, 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 like, come on, bro. You can't keep using me. How he long did last year? That. You didn't even have bro. a number. Nah, bro. <laughs> His birthday came nah, up. Bro. It was like a couple of months. Re-grief. Nah, Re-grief. You re-grief? Re-grief? too much. Yeah. I you never too much. I don't use it that much. He don't use it that much. You didn't use it on tour with him. Oh, he used it on tour? He used it on tour. You don't even say that. Grief? I don't use it. I'm using it now. I'm using it now because I messed up. Are you an excessive griefer? Like you using it like at times? I very yeah, rarely excessively. use it. No, he's done it while we've been filming workplace comedy. Like you know, my brother died, and he he'll make did. it awkward, and then he'll walk away. Just he does it on purpose <laughs> to make it awkward. But this time I was trying to do something else. <laughs> you trying to get out of the corner? I com- I completely forgot to confirm everybody on this list. Oh, sure. You know, I was just thinking about him, how much I miss him, and I was just like, Man. Wow. You can't do that. <laughs> what should I be doing? Exactly. Confirming you know what I'm saying. Yeah. That's what I'm saying. <laughs> Low key, he can do that. Until, no. Until you can, you can't say last year. That's not you even. You gotta have at least a year. Cal- don't even have an S on it. <laughs> yes. You gotta have at least two last years. Last year. Gotta be, I, nah. Look. Nah. I, once I get to a couple years ago, then maybe okay, it's too long. That's still not We're so long. six months. Yeah, it's not even six months. September, October, November, December, January, February, March. Yeah, it Give just him turned a year. March today. Give, Give him, him this year, till September. Man. Yeah. So he could just use that as a get out of jail card anytime. Yes. 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 yes, that was forty years of brotherdom down the yes. drain, like that toilet. Got back up, bro. <laughs> <laughs> no, That's what we're talking about. <laughs> we have a power toilet here, duty. and um, do we? Yeah, <laughs> you know, power toilets like goosh. Mm-hmm. It didn't go so good. somebody blew it, blew it up to the point where the, the plumber had to come, and we were saying that's the worst. <laughs> so embarrassing. The worst feeling is you like we had a homegirl at our house, and she broke the toilet. She didn't know it was breaking all the time, right? But her face when she came in, because I just happened to be walking by, she was like, "I don't. I feel like it was already like that." <laughs> <laughs> has that happened to you? Trying to make excuses. Oh, somebody's bathroom and break it? Absolutely. Okay. Yeah. I just leave. Plumbers I, see other people's shit the every house? day. I no, <laughs> that is the craziest. And they shit themselves. <laughs> <laughs> and they be they never. It's never like a petite little woman just like oh. It's always like some big burly man who looks like he just took a shit. <laughs> mm-hmm. And we're still like that's why he can't oh, like they take a shit after they fix it to make sure it's done done correctly. So, <laughs> yeah, like, check their work. All right, let's make sure. What real kind of plumbers quick. you been having? I like, found them on Postmates. <laughs> 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 they bring tools and your food. <laughs> <laughs> you go shit, so you go need this. <laughs> I touch this with both hands. You guys go buy those groupons? <laughs> <laughs> they ask you what kind of toilet you got? Power flush? <laughs> yes. <laughs> That's one of the worst parts about being the man of the house is like having to fix it. You gotta that fix happens, it. Hey, Dad, I'm like you. <laughs> You boy, mom, she's strong, independent black woman. Uh-uh. Cause dude will be sitting for a long time, and you gotta go in there, and the, the water's all sad. Uh, like, get soupy. Dog, uh, get. It turned over like, what's up? What you gonna do? <laughs> it's fermenting. It's getting ready. Uh, that's one job that's just like. Y'all ever had to use somebody that? else's plunger? <laughs> to throw up. Uh, <laughs> yeah, wash one job. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> I can't smoke cigarettes now. Hello, brother. <laughs> uh, okay, you, you came to take me on. <laughs> no one flushes uh, the uh, turd. <laughs> Is that your superhero name? <laughs> <laughs> you need some water? I don't know what that is. It's the visual of that doodle water. <laughs> it's so vivid. There's always uh, one floating. Ah, I'm yeah. glad this is here. Yay! We'll this have this me? discussion and we'll start. Okay. So as we tape this, uh-huh. um, I text the group. I said, hey, Starbucks. And I'm going to tell you the time that we did this. Just can, so you guys can know. Can I just tell them? From no, the, no, 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 no. Can I tell them? Non-biased. Don't defend yourself. Okay, Kevin text. This group, 831, Starbucks, question mark. Tahir responds at 833, large black, large black coffee. I thumbs it up. Mm-hmm. Pat responds at 836, big car- caramel <laughs> macchiato energy. Thumbs it up. So at 837 to 840, 
I'm asking myself, how long do I have to wait for Lulu to throw the <laughs> answer in before I order? Mm-hmm. I say 10 minutes. 10 minutes happens, I place the order. At 8.52, <laughs> 22 minutes later, Lulu's trying like, to slide it in. Chai tea latte over. <laughs> What are you talking about? What are you talking about? (laughs) Not the Starbucks order from 831. I know that. You just you just tell us what you like from Starbucks. She came in the classroom and just shot it out an answer. (laughs) The lecture is 30 minutes in. (laughs) You're not even even supposed to talk right now. This is a lecture. She just came in. And and that's Pythagorean's theory. (laughs) And it sat in the front. But it was right though. It was history class. No, it was history class. It's absolutely history class. We are talking about slavery. (laughs) (laughs) Sit down with the company. And that E equals MC squared. Circumference. (laughs) Okay, let's just for clarity, right? I had the focus on. I still didn't take the focus off from. You see, y'all not even just gonna talk. No, no, no. We listen. We were gonna jump in twenty two minutes later. <laughs> 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 okay, it's the fact you didn't say, "Hey, can I still put it in?" You nah. were like, "It was confidence." Thirty <laughs> minutes later. Oh, juice, <laughs> whatever you do. <drink. laughs> Still here. Because like, I said, it was either two things are going to happen. He going to say, nope, or he going to do it. So I took a chance. She didn't even throw. At, at 22 minutes, you got to leave. My bad. I missed it. Right. I My missed bad it. was driving. You know right. what? Or I just stopped by Starbucks myself and picked it up. <laughs> With my own money. That's like the pizza delivery driver like getting there and you're like, a large pepperoni. (laughs) (laughs) Nigga, I'm I'm delivering it. (laughs) Extra mushrooms, please. (laughs) She came in with with award winning NAACP energy. You would have thought she won the award. I know y'all waited because... I just won. I know. I know. Lou was like, hey, I just voted. <laughs> <laughs> I hope you get it. <laughs> I just voted. Is I just voted for 2 g How did they even let you vote? I was running behind. <laughs> right? Okay, I was running behind. I had to focus on. I was dedicated. I wanted to get here on time because y'all know I'll be late. So I was like, I'm going to be here on time. And but you then, were late. But, <laughs> but you were also late to this. <laughs> She wasn't even here at 9 o'clock. So you were late for the actual call time and late for the Pat Starbucks. Was late too. But he got his order in on time. She tried to grab a nigga Fuck while she tried. That bought him five minutes. <laughs> that let me know. We pulled in like this. Like. <laughs> I was, I was like, did we have like a split screen morning routine? Like, we have brushing our teeth at the same time. Washing your coochies at the same time. <laughs> Taking out your menstrual cup. Draining out my menstrual cup. Hey, girl, I have that, that. You just added that into morning routines, washing I coochies. Know, we're washing coochies, baby. They just, they just hit the hot uh, spot. Gotta <laughs> wash the old I'm curtains. Fine. I don't know the what kind of night is. We got a whole feminine wash, okay? Oh, we have more than that. Gotta wash, gotta wash the sleep off. Uh, <laughs> wash the sleep off my what eyes. Think, the <laughs> sleep off? Oh, what, do you think, what do you think happens that oh, night? Oh, my, oh, my eyes. <laughs> I, had to, I had to wipe the crust off my lips. <laughs> do coochies get like crusty? Like, you know the little eye oh, oh, Only if, if you do something the night before and you don't get up to flesh that thing out. Oh, he I've got caked a, up. I've got a, uh, he got a coochie. He knows. No, he said it. He said it. He's a coochie advocate. I am a coochie advocate. I ain't gonna lie. I ain't gonna lie. I am a coochie advocate. Faraday having the toys in the, in the bathroom sink like they in holsters. Oh, like, right. Like she just, it'd be the dead. regular bathroom? Yeah, and I mean our bathroom and our own suite. Nobody in there but us. Oh. Holsters. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> she has the leather thing. Oh. Did you go like this? <laughs> what? Like a brush? No, <laughs> that goes like inside. a toilet brush? Yeah. Why are they, why are they doing it that hard? I don't know. Have you never watched watch porn, though? Like, you, why would you? Wait. Uh, you're you're like, a You I live with a whole woman. <laughs> you never look. watched her? Like, hey, let me watch you. Hey, man, welcome to this song. Tell me the problem. We're not going to ask those type of questions. I get home and get less. I'm like, let me ask you a question. <laughs> Were you talking about me? I buy, I buy lube. No, no, I Kev buys lube and he giggles at the counter. <laughs> <laughs> I just. <laughs> He's Kev, like, 
got me in a full He's like, dude, this is it's fine. Glasses and everything. <laughs> <laughs> you don't know what it was like to grow up a church kid, y'all. That but was you're a, grown. Now. Every time but he grows, has re, every residual time. effect. Do you still see Melissa be like, oh, sorry? <laughs> <laughs> he won't get on the shower. Oh, I'm sorry. Oh, sorry, I'm sorry. I'm sorry. <laughs> I didn't think he was in. No. You no. want to pray now? <laughs> no. Lube is like a wild night. Like, hey, <laughs> this Thursday. <laughs> You want to use the loot? Uh, he go to Target with a hoodie on and shade. And like, let me get this loot. On his <laughs> this is they a, see his head, though. They're like, Kevin? <laughs> There's not even a security tag on this. It's not, this isn't taboo. No, come on. Give me the, the extra spicy. <laughs> Are you give eating me, these? Me. <laughs> I'll take one original and one extra crispy. <laughs> I'll take a sour cream. <laughs> Tells Melissa, what you think you're gonna do with that? <laughs> this on my pancakes. I wanna put cheddar and spice on your ass. <laughs> like, you're supposed to do what with this? <laughs> Baby, take the the baked potato one is for me. The baked potato <laughs> is for me. Flavor, food flavored lube is wild. Yeah, it's mostly like strawberry and stuff. <laughs> <laughs> to hear that, you know, you know, you know, it's almost always fruit stuff. Why to hear would definitely have a brisket lube. Are you not? Know, <laughs> I don't care if she come to bed. <laughs> Barbecue loo. <laughs> to hear, why are you pouring that on the mattress? <laughs> it's called a buffet. <laughs> it's not even the sheets. It's not even stuff you want to smell during sex. I got the crab boil loo. I got the jambalaya loo. Yep. I don't none of this. Yeah. All made by Lori. <laughs> Tony totally saturated. Crab boil lube is wild. <laughs> you, you get totally distracted. Like, I'm not even hard anymore. Yeah, it's the delicious. mesquite lube. <laughs> Farron's like, I'm ready. It's all empty. What the? She I couldn't come to wait. Bed with those little white things on her head. Like a turkey. I was in the bathroom for three minutes. I couldn't wait. <laughs> You should have yeah. taken it with you. I got you some in the you oven, though. You should have taken it You know who you married. <laughs> he turned his whole belly button to dipping sauce. Like, yum, yum, yum. Yum, yum. Mm. Uh, yum, yum, yum. I mean, everybody got it. <laughs> everybody just got it. This was a firing squad. <laughs> This was fucking brutal. Sheesh. Oh my All god! Right. I'm going to get a fan. <laughs> Can you get me some tissue? Because I didn't mess up my that makeup. That was a firing squad. Welcome I to I saw this on the internet, a podcast <laughs> sometimes about topics, but not with this, not with this core group. Everyone got it. If you haven't heard, this is a this is a great time, especially with this cast. Today we have Lulu Gonzalez. What's up? We have Patrick Houston. Oh, and mm, uh, to hear. Uh, hold on one second. That's what we doing now. You introduce it, don't you dare. <laughs> and we have to Ain't hear. no way that was <laughs> readily <laughs> available. To hear more. Wild. <laughs> just an everything bad. <laughs> I ordered this just <laughs> so but you wouldn't feel here. alone. He was a like, Cam, put it in arm's reach. <laughs> <laughs> just so you wouldn't feel alone. I Get 30 more to put in arms reach, too. my little brother, boy. (laughs) (laughs) Imagine he did a 23 and me, and they just sent him that in an envelope. (laughs) You didn't even... Cam, is that close up? With (laughs) nothing else? With no No other instructions? (laughs) So is it... Is it 90%? Uh, just this. <laughs> the next day, another dozen shows up. <laughs> Why you don't want me off the field? <laughs> Tell him what him. I know how to be a man without him. I know how to drive without him. I know how to butter without him. I know how to toast without him. Tell him what him. <laughs> I'm gonna get jelly without him. <laughs> I was a corporate breakfast for six years. He's just, he's just yelling in front of a closed bakery. To here, it's okay. There's other bakers. To hell with him. <laughs> There's other places to get bagels. <laughs> Why would he want me, man? They just couldn't pay their rent. Why would he want me, man? <laughs> I'm putting cases on all you bitches. Uh, I see oh, bagels, man. cases. Oh my god! <laughs> bagels, just, I just couldn't keep up with the demand. <laughs> Down with him. <laughs> <laughs> it was nothing personal to him. Oh. <laughs> oh. Hey, start your little funky ass show, bro. <laughs> Always call your thing Lil. When they piss off, it's on. Go on, do your little. Fuck ass show, bro. Come get on, your, I got go shit on, get to your do, little, little 
y'all going uh, with your little YouTube? Why, you, why do we do that? We <laughs> always gotta minimize. We gotta your minimize opinion. it, bro. That's how I take my power <laughs> back. Go, hey, go ahead, start your little categories and shit. Yeah. Whatever you want to talk about. Hey, <laughs> you think Obama ever heard like, "Hey, with your little presidency"? <laughs> <laughs> like, nigga. After you win, yeah, after you win, yeah. After you win, you went back to is, Chicago. There's nothing black people cannot humble you about. You will always, nigga. You a little bit. You a little free world. Uh, you gonna you gonna try to come back to Chicago? Go on back with your little secret service, your little White House. Give me your little bulletproof card. Go back to your little White House. In your little Oval Office and shit. It's on your money. Yeah, go to your little White House. It's Chicago, nigga. Go to your little meeting. What do you mean? I'm addressing the world. Your little meeting. Your little your little talent show. Do you go through your little monologues? Half the show has just been laughing. <laughs> I'm addressing we Russia. Have, we have not, this is literally just the show right here. Do your little monologues to the president is wild. Uh, the State of the Union, yeah, do your little Tuesday uh, talk. <laughs> Listen. Go on your little ass niggas plane. was in that State of the Union, they had their back to him while he was talking. <laughs> Turn around, hey man, go on with your little fuck ass speech, bro. <laughs> hey, so this is like I was like, saying. We trying to get mean? up out of here and get some heralds right after this. <laughs> I'm from Chicago. Chicago people love to tell you that's from Chicago. <laughs> nigga with his back turned to the state of union. Yeah, this nigga doing his little talking around right anyway. Oh, so I had Air Force ass, One too. Suit ass boy. <laughs> I know you want to smoke, huh? Look at that, look, look. I know, I know you want one of these, huh? Huh? You want one of these? I'd be packing the hell I, out of that car. I court. really feel like there's been one time Michelle had an argument with him. Was like, Ooh. go on in your little office. Your little go oval office. Your little, little, office. little shit. That joint ain't even circle. You got to be an oval. Like. Always extra. Yeah. <laughs> like, they already called it that before. <laughs> you could have changed it, Mr. President. Mr. President. <laughs> I wanted to see him lose his cool just once. Like... Literally had to catch himself and call somebody a bitch. Like, that would have brought me so much joy. <laughs> he, he did that oh. shit under his breath. Oh, yeah, you know what? Yeah. Like, we he heard him call uh, Kanye West a jackass. That's he pretty did. crazy. That hurt Kanye's feelings. When feeling. did he say that? And, uh, and he you can tell by how he said it. He, he didn't know. He, he, he forgot he was on camera. He's like, well, he's a jackass. Yeah. <laughs> then he was like, oh, shit. <laughs> <laughs> it was like disappointment. <laughs> oh, I said that. <laughs> This was, this was while he was uh, in presidency? Yeah. Yeah, yeah. yeah this yeah, was yeah. early, before Kanye said anything like, this is wild that we didn't agree with. <laughs> yeah. Which reminds me, were y'all watching real time when Kanye said George Bush doesn't mm -hmm. care about yes. black people? Yes. I was watching real time on yes. TV. Me and Melissa so. were watching this. Like I think it was a Hurricane Katrina yes, telethon. Yes, Katrina. He was with Mike mm -hmm. Myers. Dog, Mike Myers' face. After <laughs> that. <laughs> that boy was like... <laughs> And that's when Shrek was born. He was like, man, I got it. Be a whole different Black color. Hilarious. Hilarious. And we're going to shoot it right back to you guys. <laughs> Chris Tucker came in. Hey, man. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> what it is? He came in so loud. Oh, the rain, man. It was falling. <laughs> It like Kanye didn't know he was gonna say. He was just like right. George he was, Bush. He was building up for it. Yeah. I saw him like <laughs> he was sitting like this. I'm gonna fucking say. It. I'm just gonna do it, man. Double just, Dutch. Man, you only get one shot. Do not lose oh your chance to blow. God. It wasn't even like poetically said. <laughs> George Bush does not, not care about blacks. Cause you you see him like pause. He he was like moving on. When he started <laughs> saying it, he was like, I should have do this shit. Like, nah, he, he was like, I'm committed. I'm committed. committed. It sounds like that should have been the first thing He's he like, said. George that was your exit? <laughs> the thing is, Kanye always said wild stuff. We just used to agree with that. Mm -hmm. Like, he said that. We were like, yup, yup, because yep, mm -hmm. he flew over New Orleans. And then mm -hmm. Taylor Swift, he was like, wow, I probably I mean... wouldn't have said that right now. <laughs> but also, Single Ladies was a great video. Yeah. Yeah. And also, and we wasn't did... fucking with Taylor right. like that. <laughs> like... But then when he switched, we was like, this nigga crazy. crazy. <laughs> no, he been doing this. Mm -hmm. We just don't agree I with it anymore. I said the same thing about the baby. What baby? The baby, the rapper, the baby. Oh, I know. He I had been, he been that nigga from the jump. Yeah. And then when he, he what he do? Smack the, smack the. <laughs> smack the <laughs> I know what baby. <laughs> Who's Which baby? baby? <laughs> oh, he had to pretend he knew rap. Oh, oh yeah, 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 the baby. <laughs> Back to back. <laughs> Good <laughs> baby. I just want to rock. <laughs> body yada yada. I don't got body but no, you're right though. He told everybody he wasn't shit for really? the jump. He yeah, really did. I'm a dog ass nigga. I shot somebody. I he fucked really these right. hoes, and then he did it. He did exactly what he, he said. He peed on a dead do. on a dead body in his first video. Oh, he how was, you know the body was was it? Oh, it was fake dead. Yeah, well, yeah. Of course. Well, I mean, y'all made it seem like he gangster. He got dead bodies well, he, in he, video. He, he killed somebody. He did kill somebody, and uh, he killed somebody in his house. He killed people twice. And he didn't killed he? somebody on Walmart. 
the baby? So horrible yeah. place to die. See why she didn't get it when she asked. Uh, but she no good. rap though. She just don't know I like. Know, what do I, I don't, don't know, know their personal life. What you, rap do I don't know? You don't know <laughs> a lot of rappers. Kev did not know Anita Baker until Tony Baker put that's him on not blast rap. about that's it. Not rap, that though. I know. I'm just weird saying. That's just, that's just, <laughs> that was a, but you don't know any rappers. But like Anita you don't Baker, know Anita Baker. Whitney Houston, Aretha Franklin. You just found out who Luther Vandross is. You ain't hip. You don't know about this trap life. Trap life 101. Temptations. The four tops. <laughs> Motley Crue. That is a very point taken, sir. Very good point taken. Motley Crue. You don't know Dream That's Girls. <laughs> you don't know about this rap. Shy Rack. <laughs> Pat got a coochie. <laughs> if nothing else work, I'll just go back to that. Quiz me on rappers, and I'll tell you if I know for real. Okay. Uh, Capone. Did you? Uh, oh, you know. Gunna, Gunna I know. Yeah. He Capone. was uh, with the Rico. Uh huh. I don't know a song, though. Capone. Noriega and Capone. Capone. I know Noriega and Capone. You know Give Benny, me one song. You know Benny the Butcher? No, no, no. Yeah. Wait, wait, wait. Griselda. Wait, wait. Griselda. Okay, no. Capone and Noriega. Give me one song. Would I have to know, name their songs just or one. be aware? Just, just one. Capone and Noriega? Yeah. Oh, they got Capone and Noriega. Stop. We be rapping. Stop. Stop. Capone and Noriega. We be rapping? We, be rapping. we from New York. What I don't think anyone's that? ever said we be rapping. <laughs> <laughs> That's just a blanket bad guess. <laughs> Pastor Bassett, Troy. We be rapping. Ooh. Pastor Troy. Oh, Pastor Troy is that, uh, he's from Texas. He's from Georgia. He, he be rapping like he from Texas. <laughs> he does not. <laughs> Pastor Troy got that song. Bip. Uh, <laughs> they do that dance to it. You know what I'm talking about? We also bust. Oh no, that's not. These are Pat. also all not new artists. Okay, <laughs> give me give me something from the locks. The locks. <laughs> oh, that's that's uh, Jada kissing them. Who else? We have Jada kiss Sleek Looch. <laughs> no, uh, Sheik. Sheik. Sheik Looch. Styles P. Styles P. Styles P. Uh, what was it? Sheik Looch. Sheik, Sheik Looch. What I say? You, you said Sleek <laughs> or Steep. I don't even Steve know who looks that is. is what you say. <laughs> See, but I got the lock. I don't feel like Bad Boy Street Team. I couldn't work the lock. No, no, that's, that's not that's, that's not the that's lock. Yeah, that's, 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 <laughs> that's what we're talking about. That wasn't a reference game. <laughs> now that was the same group. He was talking about the lock. Yeah, yeah, but yeah. he said that's a, that's a Kanye but bar. That's a, that wasn't the lock song. Yeah, I thought we were saying who I know about. Like, <laughs> I know people who've talked about the locks. <laughs> Kanye. I got a hundred guns, a hundred clips, and I'm from ja New York. That's Ja Rule. Ja Rule. No, a hundred guns, a hundred clips. That's Ja Rule. That's ja Rule. That is, that is Jada Kiss. No, there's, there's, Jada Kiss is on the song. Uh, but it's not Jada song. Kiss's song. It's oh, Ja Rule. Kiss is from the, yeah. But Jada Kiss said that. Right? No, ja Rule. Ja Rule says that. No, Everybody says that. I have it on my sketch. Literally. That's from the. Everybody that's you from should go Jada Kiss. From the. From the. Everybody says the hook in that song. From the. Verses. I'm not from Miami. I'm from New York. We outside. I got a hundred guns, a hundred clips. You haven't yeah, named he's one Jada Kiss song. <laughs> <laughs> he's, we've so far got right. a mention from Kanye, a versus. <laughs> oh, Jada Kiss. <laughs> kiss, kiss. I'll be Jada Kiss. <laughs> Stop, man. Start with your little show, I bro. don't know why I have to know the songs and know the prove I know rap. Because you don't know rap. I know it. You don't. You know gospel gangsters? I do know that. <laughs> I don't that's know, not that's a thing. Know, no, that not, is absolutely that's thing. real. That's I had real? I had a couple of that. Grape albums. Street. Yeah, Gospel Gangsters was. They, they was rapping their ass. They off, from though. Grape Street. No, they just there was a. I think Grape Street was a record. Yeah, uh, record I, label. I definitely had a couple. When of Gospel I was a Gangsters. kid, my parents bought me. We went to a Christian bookstore. Mm hmm. Um, and they bought me. They was like, you like? Because I got in trouble for. Uh, <laughs> I got in trouble for listening to TLC's Red Light Special <laughs> album. I mean, my dad took my headphones randomly. Was like, what's this? And it was literally. <laughs> Take off your clothes. How loud were your headphones that he was like? <laughs> they weren't even What were you doing that made him say, what you listening to? I think to? I was body rolling. <laughs> <laughs> you gotta live. And he snatched them and he was listening to TLC. So they took me to a oh. Christian bookstore and they bought me Gospel Gangsters. It was like, you want to listen to the hip hop? They thought that was <laughs> the fact that they put the Z on the M for Gangsters. Wait, hang on. You gotta let them it's know. Crazy. Yeah. You gotta it's let them know. It's crazy. Yes. They from LA. Mr. Solo, DJ Dub, and what TikTok. What was DJ Dub? What were the TikTok. raps like? I don't they was rapping their ass off. I, I don't know. remember a word. Well, they was gangsters. Judas? Was they rapping about they Judas? Like, they was just like... Gangsters. They were like reformed gangsters. Rapping about God. But what did, what did play, they talk I'll about play, that was gangster? I'll play you a song. There's nothing about in the God. church that's gangster. God was gangster. He was killing Judas people. was gangster. But you can't rap as God. You can't rap as you God. Can talk that's about blasphemous. Like, God, boy. He killed niggas. <laughs> All right, this is... I'm gonna Pull just, up and flood I'm going to just play their... their <laughs> plague you. This video. trying to plague you. Pull up and plague you. 
It's on Change. You gonna play it on YouTube? Yeah. Oh. It's a gospel gangster song called Change. You gotta play an old one. That one ain't. That's the, just to have the most views. Okay. <laughs> well, they have new ones? Well, no. I'm just talking about like. <laughs> just picture young Kevin walking down the street to this. <laughs> Pointing at random I'll stuff. Kill the devil. <laughs> Randomly said, helping nigga, old I'll people. Kill the devil. <laughs> it sounds like you waving to people yeah. in the neighborhood. Hey. Devil, you a nigga that I kill. <laughs> Doing laundry. <laughs> <laughs> helping people when they are down. <laughs> You might as well be Dub C. It should. Go ahead and turn that off. Are they allowed to beef with other? <laughs> <laughs> Most of Christian hip hop beef is like you ain't saved as much as you, you ain't used saved to be. as much as me. As me as you used to be. Used to be big on tap. That's for real. Like the most of the beef isn't about lyrics. It's just like he he made a song with uh with a real rapper or like uh, it's mostly spiritual beef not well, like you don't got well, how, no bar what if somebody what's had a better baptism point? like you know like <laughs> what's better the, would it be the dunk or the ceremonial yeah, the whole <laughs> thing like the whole like you got a better pool you got better maybe you got alkaline water like it's how you come out of the water if you, you come, out, you of come water, out the like, water like like very majestic like yeah. that, oh, that nigga or if your it. robe got like bedazzled on it as you come, you come out, out of the water, water very majestic. you know <laughs> that nigga don't miss <laughs> <laughs> Are people you come out their the baptism water? come up? Hey. Come, come yeah. that, that might be next. <laughs> yeah. You come out the water like LeBron as you come out, you feel like that? Splash like, of water. Yeah. <laughs> How are there not like overhead cameras in baptism? <laughs> That's a pretty cool little photo op. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. They're like, hold it, hold it, hold it. It's a good throw, moment. Throw, 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 throw. <laughs> they hold his breath out of the water. <laughs> I feel like people don't get baptized as much as they used to. They don't. Churches don't be having pools. like That's not sanitary. Yeah. Is is it? Mm. You know, mm. know. Oh, like COVID? Because yeah. it's blessed. Why would it be unsanitary? I mean, if Don't you if you but seven, you seventeen in water and come out like. In your, your hair, in the church skin particles. Oh yeah. Oh, people behind. that don't wash their ass correctly. Imagine you like the, t- the 15th that. one, yeah. and it's like a little brown by that point. Yeah. Yeah. And it, it was it was three kids that went yeah. before you. And you see these kids playing before. Like, yeah. <laughs> how blessed is this water? Can you re-bless? You there's see no, these kids playing. There's no filtration. Yeah. You know how they play. You know they play hard. They outside with no shoes on. Yeah. He getting baptized here? Nah. Yeah, there's, nigga, no filter- there's no filtration in the pool. Sending this with You know, ours was just a bathtub at my at my home church, and I never thought about it like i think like three people got baptized before me the day i got baptized but i never thought about it also i was one of them kids who was playing so they're probably like this little musty kevin going i'm not giving egg would you last what if you didn't get baptized and you died like nah kevin's musty so i'm yeah, not going to I, I admit it with my mouth i believe he died for my sins that's all that matters i just gotta say real that. quick i just gotta say, I ain't <laughs> <laughs> I used to think about that all the time when right. I was a kid. Like, if you just be like, do sin your whole life, and then on your deathbed be like, all right, man, I'm sorry. <laughs> <laughs> Forgive me for my sins. <laughs> but people are always like, but you can't know when you die. And I was like, but it, but if somebody was on their deathbed after, a, like, hella sin. What if there was a water, like, tank underneath your deathbed? So, like, whenever it happened, just pull the string and fall in. <laughs> so it's like a circus, break like a it, carnival game. Break in case of emergency <laughs> baptism? <laughs> You're like, I think it's coming. Ah! <laughs> <laughs> Made it. <laughs> you didn't have it like, oh, not you. Last second. <laughs> you were an asshole your whole life. I know. Not at the end. <laughs> <laughs> Buzzer be the baptism. <laughs> How was your boring life? <laughs> that used to, make you, I used to make me mad as a kid. Like we, I would be like, dog, there's no way I have to be saved my whole life and then somebody can just ask for forgiveness At late in end. life. Like, yeah. what's the point for me then? Yeah, yeah, I'm, that's why I'm going to have fun, baby. I'm going to have fun. Well, on the I, flip side of that, you could be perfect your whole life and then on your deathbed, like... Be an asshole? Like, fuck. <laughs> well, that would be so... That's even worse. Like, poke that's you with what, the needle, you're like, fuck! And then get Aaron and you die. <laughs> And but then you're getting denied. And then like, Are you sure? Nah, that's nah, you was cussing, bro. That, that's you why was I was cussing, always confused when I, when I watch these movies and they be on death row and they be like, they got the priest coming in to this death row inmate. You can one last time forgive your sins. Like, no, motherfucker, he don't deserve that. Like, I don't want him in heaven. Let him go. Let, let him kill, go. He killed 10 people, bro. <laughs> yeah, why did he get to be forgiven? No, that's no. wild. Yeah. Hey, you still trying to go to heaven, though? He like, he like, hi, hi. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Yeah, yeah. 
Nah, help it ain't cool. a GED program, bro. You can't. <laughs> I yeah, didn't, yeah, yeah, you can't. Get I that. didn't think. I didn't think I was going. <laughs> I didn't think I was going. I'm actually really happy to see you. Please show up. You're like, oh shit. <laughs> nah, we're good. We don't want him up here causing that ruckus. Yeah, I Nigga was just stealing, confused. Nigga stealing angel wings and shit. Now nah, we good, bro. Keep him down there, bro. And the crazy part, the priest be walking up to the deathbed like, you, we going? Let's go. And they all calm and shit like, I'm going to heaven now. Like, I'm cool. Like, <laughs> Damn. Speed this up, please. <laughs> Execute me fast. This is taking too long. I'm going to get to heaven. Imagine you got to go to jail and you in jail for like unpaid parking tickets and a warrant for that and you in jail with somebody that killed like 10 people. That's the thing. Jail shouldn't be the same. Yeah. Like smoking weed or selling... Selling weed or, or whatever drug uh -huh. should not be murder so drug. So now that, you want segregated prisons. <laughs> yes. <Yeah. laughs> murder jail and I sold weed? I sold weed jail should have like a pool table and stuff. <laughs> like At just, least a Spain Just table hang out up. here yeah. off, the, off the streets. Stop smoking. <laughs> Stop selling drugs. Cause, no, cause you know why? Cause murder. being a hustler is a gateway to being a bigger criminal. So it's like, what if you was a kingpin? You gateway. Put, yeah, That's you put, hilarious. Gateway, gateway crime. crime. Gateway crime, man. I sold enough drugs. I want to kill somebody. <laughs> That's exactly how it happened. This business is moving us, too fast. And power has taught us nothing. <laughs> Selling weed is a gateway crime <laughs> for bigger crimes. No, I'm telling you, in every job, there's people who just want to get by. Some people don't. I don't want to be Frank Lucas. I don't want that much pressure. People want to kill him. I just want to sell enough weed to make right. rent. And get some tacos. <laughs> like, there's right. just a right. drug taco. Yeah, some people are like well, some people. A drug dealer got a call off work today. Like, man, it's raining. I'm not finna go out to some the drug dealers are drug addicts, and they just sell enough to feed their habit. That's like the most self sufficient <laughs> lifestyle. Man. Just enough. <laughs> yeah, I sell it. I shoot it. <laughs> <laughs> I'm off the radar. <laughs> no cops are looking for me because I look like the shit I'm selling to. I'm racist. <laughs> I'm a C plus student <laughs> drug killer. I don't want to go to college. I don't want to be the head of drugs. You don't want to get your master's? <laughs> That's the thing about the drug shows that I watch. Like, bro, that all that money ain't worth the stress. Mm -hmm. right. You got the police trying to catch you, and you got people trying to kill you on rivals, and then you got people within your own organization trying to kill you. Ain't mm -hmm. enough money for all that Then your family be trying to kill you, <laughs> too. Oh. Like, you be like, damn, I just wanted an eighth. Like, I just... <laughs> police are stressed enough, too. They're already, like, trying to take down kingpins, attaching strings and shit. They're not worried about, like, Bro. nigga, you too? <laughs> I sold weed for two weeks, and it was the most stressful time. And not I wasn't even selling. I was selling Reggie. I said it was big men. Hilarious. I I know it was, and I Selling still freckles. was like... <laughs> a bag of freckles? I, I was freckles doing this, you, doing this in, the, in the bag. He's like, yeah, this, <laughs> this gonna fuck him up right here. See here, I, that shit didn't get me high at all. <laughs> <laughs> but, did you put, but did you put it on your eggs, though? <laughs> Look, I... You gotta put it on your eggs, <laughs> brother. You didn't tell me to do this. <laughs> <laughs> Why would I, I do that? I said, this shit is good for everything. <laughs> But did you put it on your <laughs> eggs? <laughs> I, I, I had an interview to be a drug dealer, and that shit was stressful. <laughs> interview? Ooh. Yeah. <laughs> Why do you think you can sell drugs for me? <laughs> and, and then he kept asking, how much you think you going to sell? <laughs> how much was this in person? Want? Huh? Was this in person? Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> you wear pants? <laughs> She can't tell. Just, just like Hillary Clinton. I had a free case. Like case. <laughs> you imagine somebody laying their outfit out for a drug interview the next day? <laughs> <laughs> Wait, are this, for real, you, you interviewed? <laughs> I feel like she told us this before. I never heard this story. I think it got the briefcase. Drug the, dealers have put the, put the scale in the briefcase. We're like, yeah, this is going to kill him when I pop this. <laughs> what's, it, what's that interview style because... that's most popular right now? It's like a uh, behavior based or something. Where you like, they ask you, give me an example of where you were a good teammate. <laughs> they asked, the, was it behavior based? Man? <laughs> that's because he was my supplier in general. And I was like, yo, I need to make some bread. I was doing bad. <laughs> and he was like, I put you on. And then he's like, all right, come back tomorrow. We talk about this. I was like, like an interview? Hilarious. He was like, come back tomorrow. We'll talk about that. <laughs> I'm not going to say that. I can't say it's an interview because that's weird, but yes. But also, yes. But also, yes. <laughs> Did you give him your work history? <laughs> Did you, you sold uh, chocolates in elementary school? <laughs> oh, Girl Scout cookies. Like, Girl Scout cookies. Did you win I'm a good hustler. 
Really? You know, I worked at, I was a Girl Scout. You know, like, I know how to push. <laughs> you no know? one was so more Thin Mints than me. <laughs> thin Mints, weed, there's very little difference. Like, you know, Matter of fact, I can, we can put them together. Yeah, you know? We get two boxes and a joint. You know that this is illegal, though. <laughs> <laughs> you can't Clean be in front of Ralph. Girl Scout is hilarious. Lou <laughs> was like, I'll go She's... right in front of the grocery store. No, you, she oh, has no, a you bell, can't. ding, 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 ding. <laughs> Cannabis. <laughs> Like Canada. Santa Claus? Cannabis! Cannabis! Get like, ma'am, jail. Yeah. <laughs> so I'm going to the good jail. I'm going, I'm going to the weed jail with the pool table. So I'm cool. Your drug dealer's like, so you were arrested in an hour and a half. I lost all my products. Now I gotta kill you. It's not lost. It's, it's, it's in lockup. I know exactly where it is. Were you oh, at a Gelson's? <laughs> well, on the upside, you uh, you set a new you set a new record. So a lot the of worst drug dealers. It's a lot of foot traffic. <laughs> <laughs> That's the other thing about drug deals. You mess up too much, then they kill you. Oh, they definitely gonna kill you. No, I was watching this show on on, on uh, uh, HBO about the gun, about Baltimore Gun Trace Task Force, right? Mm -hmm. So they were supposed to just take guns from. They were like, we can't stop the drugs. It's too much. Yeah. Let's just focus on the violence. So they started focusing on taking guns from from criminals. These police started taking guns, then finding drugs, and then like, well, we'll take these too. See, and we'll take the money. And then they start taking the drugs and then selling the drugs back to drug dealers. That's a smart. The police? Right, the police. So what happened was they stole the drugs from a drug dealer, right? They, they, they like, raided his house and took his money. And he's like, bro, like, I need that. <laughs> just, just arrest me regular. Don't, <laughs> don't keep the drugs. Because he's like, if you take the drugs and don't put them into evidence, they're going to think I stole them. Yeah. And they nah. were like, sucks to be you. And they kept them, and the drug dealers killed that dude. What show is this? This is a. Uh, it's called We We Own the City, but it's based uh, oh, on a true story. Oh, I know like that. I know that show. The Baltimore Police, yeah. basically after the wire ended, yeah, yeah, they were yeah. like guns now, and the mm -hmm. police became drug dealers. Like literally stole guns, cash, and were just like, we don't make enough money. And then they would only go to work as police for like three hours and bill like twelve hours. I was like, you guys Damn. are doing crime I'm not about that. as police. <laughs> yeah. That's that is I literally the opposite of your job. Yeah. Easy was, way in. That's like a drug dealer like going to rehab clinics and helping people like, yeah, man, you know, drugs is bad. Here's some methadone. Like, <laughs> that's the opposite of your job. That's infiltration. Yeah. It's that's just smart. like, all I got to do is become a cop yeah. and I could just do the same you could, criminal activity. you can become a cop and less time you can become a barber. It was like... <laughs> a nigga was in barber school was like, wait, this don't make no sense. <laughs> I can be a cop and sell dope and get <laughs> away with it. That's the thing. That. Like, honestly, if I was a police officer... That's just common sense. You're making 60, 70 grand, whatever, 100 grand, and you find $100,000 cash and that. nobody knows, mm -hmm. who is turning in the whole thing? Nobody. Because right. you know what? It's turning 50. Right. Bro, Police was... found a dollar fifty. <laughs> you're just posing with it. <laughs> and a Ziploc bag? <laughs> <laughs> No way. I would, I would keep finding the same amount. They'd be like, he found another 10000 He's really on the case. About 75 cents. <laughs> just quarters. We should, we should just stop doing the press like conferences, this, you, like this. Why'd you report this, Lou? <laughs> I'm an honest cop. <laughs> the police found an everything bagel. <laughs> the scene of a crime. Looks like somebody took You're a bite. Your body. Body. <laughs> this bad boy in. All my niggas getting free. <laughs> no jelly was harmed in the making. Of this He's episode. just posing like this. Like, where's the. I hate it. Yeah. Yes. Yes. So it's, just, it's, about, it's just this part. It's just this, this part. I'm keeping this, this part. This is about as big as it was. <laughs> I'm keeping this one. That's why I'm keeping this one. That's why I'm keeping this one. like, sir, this could be anything. This is the bottom half. I keep finding bottom halves. I don't know. It's a pandemic going on. You have teeth. You have teeth in your teeth. No, I was here before. No, no, I just got cavities. Police found an empty box of bagels. At the crime scene, though. Every crime scene. Every crime scene. These cops were awful, though, man. Like, they were planting drugs on... Like, everything people accuse cops of, they did. Oh, like, yeah. Planting drugs. Like, literally taking drugs out of their pocket and then throwing it and being like, Lou, 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 Lou. Huh? The Girl Scout weed smoke. <laughs> what happened to these oh, body cams wasn't a, uh, a thing back no, then? No, what happened was the way they got caught was they was on a wiretap, the actual other police, and they was like, yeah, and I sold it to to this guy, basically say it's Cam. Uh -huh. And I sold it to Hill. And they were like, Hill? Who, who, who's that? They're like, o Officer Hill. You know they be stealing from us and selling it back. The other police were like, wait, what? So then they Hill started. Was behind <laughs> <him>. <laughs> He was listening to him. He pulled a Homer Simpson and went to the bushes. Basically, what happened? He got out of the police van and was like, No, 
I think he meant a guy on the street named Officer Hill. No, 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 no. no. Officer <laughs> Hill, band number 238, That's what they did, though. They were just talking casually, like, these niggas stole from us again, and they're trying to sell it back to us, or they sold it to this guy. We got to buy it back. And the other police were like, Sean? He was like, no. <laughs> yes. Yes. <laughs> so they got a police informant who ratted on the police, and he got a wiretap. So they basically got caught because the drug dealers snitched on them, or dry snitched on them. Yeah, the drug dealers were selling. The drug, drug dealers, dealers were under investigation, and they got the police caught. Mm -hmm. So would that guy be a snitch on the streets? No, no or because hero? he didn't know. You talking about the drug dealer? No, the, guy, the informant who snitched on the police and took them down, like... That's like reverse street rules. <laughs> <laughs> reverse Uno. But that's the cops. <laughs> we out. It, it was the cops. <laughs> we out. We out. <laughs> we got a wire on you. We no. We got a wire on you. We want our crack back. We want our crack back. Drug You're marching wired. Downtown. <laughs> they marching. <laughs> but that's we want our crack back. We want our crack back. <laughs> No, you're under yeah. arrest. <laughs> <laughs> Criminals arrest. <laughs> That's it. You can't do that. It's like, okay. <laughs> we got you on the tape. <laughs> Wait, weren't you worried? Yes. <laughs> we were talking about what you did. I know I'm a criminal. <laughs> Police are like, it out. was him. <laughs> <laughs> Gangsters are like, I, I, I see a snitch. I don't, I don't know who to kill. <laughs> I don't get these rules. Oh, that's a hard decision. <laughs> Fuck. Uh, who? He, which, he snitched, Fuck. but it was the police. Kill everybody. Just kill everybody. Let's start a whole new thing. That's always the answer. That's yeah. the start of a whole new thing. Kill everybody. Let's start a whole new thing. Like, <laughs> yeah. like Spider-Man? Spider -Man? <laughs> 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 All right, another complete waste of an episode. <laughs> the first one we just got to get out of our system. We you ain't seen each other. We ain't seen each other topics? together in a lot of topics. First episode is, is is a wash. I don't know how to title it. We talk from everything from poop to Starbucks to drugs. Uh, but this is I saw this on the internet. We're here every Monday. The comedians switch out. The stories are ridiculous. Sometimes we don't even talk about nothing. Follow us wherever podcasts are. Uh, this has been Lulu Gonzalez. This has been To Hear More. Patrick Houston, Kev on stage. We'll see you next time. Bye. Bye.